Lent has a way of changing our lives when we cook and break bread together. Hello, I'm Father Leo Paddlinghug, host of GraceBeforeMeals.com, and this is CRS Rice Bowl's Global Kitchen. Each week of Lent, we feature a meatless recipe from a country where your gifts to CRS Rice Bowl are making a difference. This year, we're celebrating CRS Rice Bowl's 40th anniversary. Since the 1970s, CRS Rice Bowl has come a long way and received many blessings over the course of its journey. In fact, it's CRS Rice Bowl's rich history that lets me know the money I'm saving by giving up my daily latte will be put to good use, helping my brothers and sisters around the world. Remember, everything I'm going to show to you today is available on the CRS Rice Bowl app, which you can download at crsricebowl.org. This week's global kitchen recipe, gallo pinto, comes from Nicaragua, where CRS is helping farmers learn how to both protect their coffee plants from leaf rust and grow other crops like plantains and sweet potatoes. Growing more than one type of crop helps families in Nicaragua build bountiful farms and sustainable futures. Gallo Pinto is a traditional dish and eaten for any meal in Nicaragua, even breakfast. I'm excited to try this recipe out with you today, so let's get started. First, we'll chop one large onion, one bell pepper, and three garlic cloves. Saute these three in a large pot with four tablespoons of fair trade olive oil. Then, stir in two cups of rice until onions are soft. Next, we're going to add four cups of water and cook covered until most of the water has been absorbed. Now it's time to add two 16-ounce cans of red beans, make sure you drain them first, and one bay leaf. Mix this well and cook over medium heat for 15 minutes. Add more water if necessary. Remove the bay leaf and serve the gallo pinto hot with cheese or, as I like it, with a fried egg on top and season it with salt and pepper, a delicious meal to share with your loved ones. Before we try this together, remember a blessing for this food. The people of Nicaragua, you who are watching this video and your generosity to the rice bowl. Let's give this a taste. Mm. Delicious anytime. Don't forget, you can get this and other recipes with the CRS Rice Bowl app or at crsricebowl.org. Be sure to check out our next video where I'll be cooking a scrumptious recipe from Niger. And until then, I'm Father Leo and this is the CRS Rice Bowl's Global Kitchen reminding you that what you give up for Lent changes lives.